The Egyptian Armed Forces releases a new video statement emphasizing the magnitude of its security preparations for the presidential election. A militant group responded with a bomb on Saturday, targeting Alexandria Security Management Bureau. Two were killed in the attack. Earlier, ISIL threatened to attack polling stations, aiming to frighten citizens away from the ballots. It's clear that ISIL is targeting the election. The army statement is a message to give comfort to the public, to gain the people's trust to turn out to vote. At the same time, the army is defying these group's threats. There is no doubt that President el-Sisi will win. But to his supporters, winning with high turnout is crucial. We must participate. The country is moving forward in this development. Our turnout will show the people's support to that road. During all elections Egypt went through since 2011, there was strong political battle between groups or strong candidates. This year, it's only President El Sisi and a negligent candidate, Musa Mustafa Musa, who doesn't belong to a political ideology. So, it will be very difficult to convince people to go to vote, yet the turnout is very important. We are not isolated from the world. A high turnout. To gain legitimacy in the world's eyes, there must be a high turnout, so the elections would not be a point of criticism. Women are expected to dominate the vote this year. Youth represent more than half of the population. Their turnout, however, is expected to be weak. I will not participate because there is no competition in the first place. The president is running alone in the race. He's going to win anyway. I won't free my time. The elections are not important this year. Most of my friends and other youth won't vote. To us, watching a football match could be more important. To increase the turnout, the Egyptian authorities have decided to hold a national vote for three days starting Monday. Egypt has around 60 million registered voters this year. In 2014, President El Sisi won the election with about 24 million votes. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Cairo. The vote will start on Monday from 9 a.m. for three days. Egyptians uh, will start to go the, to the ballot stations. And uh, many are putting a lot of eyes about the turnout because it is an indicator of um, not just about who's going to win, but how popular is the Egyptian president. Mm. Indeed, of course, we'll be looking out to see how that uh, voter turnout shapes up over the next few days. Thanks very much, Adele Al-Mahoui, joining us there live from Cairo.